we're going to look at in-fight, in-fight tactics. In this particular case, we're looking at breaking the guard. For whatever reason, maybe he's thrown his hands up and he wants to immediately fight and has vocalised it. Or maybe this is in the fight and we're just at this, if you were to take a snapshot of it, we're here, this close, yeah, before we ended up something like this. I really want to knock him out, but he's got these two things in the way. What can I do to manipulate that? So there's, there's a couple of tactics that we're going to look at, but one of the simple ones is just to pat down. Not to grab, but just to pat. Now you're going to work it at an elongated range first. Kind of a range that doesn't make sense. Almost like here. Boom. But what I want you to learn that is so you look, start to get the, formulate the headbutt right. Because when you start to take it close, what happens is people pin and then they go boom. Like some Scottish person. Right? What I want you to do is be ballistic with the headbutt as you pin. So you go bam, that. Now if we shorten the range, it'd be this, boom, that. See what I mean? There's no wind up. It's literally just go boom straight in. In terms of where you headbutt, you want this area here. Right? Try and go for the side as well. So I'm looking for jawline, cheekbone, even into the neck. You're not going to knock him out. In fact, I've not seen many headbutts that have knocked people out. The face is smashed, they're stunned, but they're on their feet. And it's psychologically dependent on what happens next. So they'll look and realize what a mess they were, and then what no fucking more. Or they'll just, oh, we're doing that, are we? And we're coming back in. So understand that when I'm doing this, boom, boom, it's an opener for something else. But also, I'm interrupting his thought process. So I'm just going in, headbutt, knee, elbow. Okay? So if you do it quickly, it's from here. It's, it's done. Now, it doesn't have to be done in that particular order. And you don't even have to do all three. You could just go from here. Bum, bum, bum. You might just go in from here. I can talk about it. That. Do you understand? It's just a way of, while I'm doing that, he's not thinking about that. Just for a fraction of a second, because I'm occupying his brain. So we're going from here. Pin, headbutt, knee, elbow. And I want you to work it at that pace. Clear? All right, go. Next thing we're going to look at, come closer. Again, he's got this, got this guard up. All right, you're going that way, fine. So he's got this guard up from here. He's protecting his face. I want to go down the middle. You're just going to go from here, small circle, big circle. So I'm going to go from here, bam, bam, that, straight over. Just to knock this out of the way, boom. Just for a fraction, just so I get that little clearance there. And then what you do, well, I say small circle, bigger circle. So that could be a hook. It could be from here, boom, bam, elbow. To give him going forward, bum bum. Or it could be bum boom. Forearm to the back or to the side of the head. Alright, so for me, that, that kind of works when I'm at range. So I might go bum bum this way. Or I might even go bum boom this way. What I want you to get good at is the hook or the short punch. So we go small circle, bigger circle. Bam bam. That. All right? When you're working with your partner, go this pace, boom, boom. Okay, from here, put it in the way. So I need to feel that, shh, that, like I've cleared something out of the way. All right, have fun. It's, it's still compliant, but what you, you're actually feeding your partner. You're giving him something, some kind of opportunity for him to do something. So just like you were doing my go, his go. The only thing is now we're going to move around a little bit. And I might leave this out a little bit. And I'll give him the opportunity to take that, boom, 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 boom. Yeah, no, that's no, all right. All right, something happens. Then we move around from here and leave something out. <laughs> That I just see that opportunity, I take it. Okay? So now you just keep moving back and forth, round, leave it out, boom, boom. Got it? So it's just a slop, bit of sloppiness means, oh, there. And you can even do it just close. There, boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that's what I want. So either stay far and leave something out, or just be close enough for him just to work his straight away. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah? Mm.